and it cost me $2,500 right now. The location matters a lot. Fridge and freezer. Freezer and fridge. Bruh, it's big as hell. to another video it's a girl vlog with Gucci and we're back with another vlog I don't know why I keep slapping my hands at me so anyways this is like I'm just gonna take this moment to you know tell everyone or wish everyone a happy new year and welcome to 2024 2020 2024 you get what I mean this new year is going well for you I hope you're smashing your goals I hope you're on the right track you know let's get let's 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 get it moving. But yeah, that's by the way. I just wish everyone a happy new year and I hope this year is going to be a year of you standing on business and you know getting on your boss girl, boss man, whatever shit you want to be on, just be on it as long as it's positive and even if it wants to be negative, no problem. Okay, that's by the way. So in today's vlog, I know you guys can see from the description, I know you're probably wondering how the hell is that possible? But yeah, I'm going to give you guys my apartment tour yes i moved to a new apartment it's been a week since i moved here and fairly speaking i didn't see this happening but it's okay it's okay by the way i'm going to give you guys a tour of this apartment it's fully furnished and it cost me two thousand five hundred dollars rent and i'm going to explain to you why it's that price so keep watching this video and you're also going to help me judge if it's even worth it or if i should just run you know but yeah that's by the way so i'm going to explain the price i'm going to show you everything in this apartment and why they decided to you know give you the price but before we get right into this video i just wanted to put in your mind that when it comes to real estate i'm not a real estate person but when it comes to real estate in this world the location matters a lot but i'm going to save all those details for like the end of this video so if you're curious and you want to know and you want to see Please stay to the end of the video and don't forget to like, share, subscribe. If you're new to this channel and you just want to watch this video and pass, is it fair? Tell me why it's fair. Just subscribe. Literally, click, please. I'm begging you, please. I'm begging just. This year should be a year of help me to grow my subscribers. But yes, that's by the way. No pressure. If you love my content, please like, share, support, and subscribe. So without talking too much, because I always do talk too much, let's get right into this video. Okay, so I have to like start this vlog from the very entrance of this apartment because yeah, you know, I want to give you guys like a feel of what it is or what it looks like by the way. I don't know why I'm skipping. It doesn't make any sense when I'm So basically, hold on. Um do I even have my keys? Jesus, if I lock myself outside. Sorry. <laughs> so guys, I'm going to start this video. Yo. <laughs> but when you walk into the apartment, right? This is what you're faced with. Like you're faced with this cute ass, you know, little setting. I do like it because of the, you know, colors and the way it's kind of blending. That's the thing. So when you walk in, right? You, let's go to the sitting area. You have this couch like this couch is so soft i'm not even going to lie like it's extremely soft and it's kind of like um foldable so it can be a couch it can also be like a bed i'm going to like set on my tripod and show you like what i mean i'm not still used to it because anytime i turn it into a bed it's always a struggle to get it back up here and <laughs> bruh i'm not ready but i'll do it for the sake of youtube okay so it's kind of like refoldable foldable and over here we have like this cute marble coffee table and yeah pretty much and then the rug i'm not really like a huge 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 fan of rugs but i gotta do what i gotta do you know <laughs> it's it's what it is but yeah the rug is here but it's hard because i cannot maintain rug to be very fair so we have a single armchair this is the only thing that i kind of find weird because of where it is i don't just know why it's just directly beside the tv but it's not something like it's so bad and we go here we have the tv is a smart tv so i could watch like netflix whatever i want inside here okay now i want to show you guys the reason the main reason why i said i was going to take this apartment was this view look at this view one of those kind of views that are just like um you know you want to get your life together you just want to be that it girl 
gym girl pilates girl go to the gym come for a walk nice view wake up bruh this is the view this is it nothing more nothing less so this view is like because i could see like almost like every connecting road to the city and it's so beautiful because i get to see like high-rise buildings i get to see like the old traditional turkish buildings and i get to also see a mosque now this is the only downside of this view there is literally a mosque beside me and this is my alarm because this is what wakes me up every morning but it's not something that we can't deal with i'm just going to show you guys one more this view okay let's give it up for the view this is the mosque like i'm talking about right it's pretty pretty very much aesthetic and it's it's just it's just dreamy to be very honest but the only thing that i have an issue is with that that, that sound that sound over there it frustrates my life but it's not something that we can't deal with okay but look at it like there's high-rise buildings you get to also like if you go to the right side right you could see like old traditional buildings like one thing with turkey is that they try to maintain their architecture so you see the high-rise buildings you see like connecting roads i don't know if it's like so much of a view from my phone but i could see a lot from eyesight okay it's the, it's the shit but yeah that's for the view okay so when you turn this way after you walked to the sitting room you're faced with like the kitchen and the kitchen is kind of cute i'm not going to lie i'm telling you for for real right now like this kitchen is the truth i have like enough cupboard space if you can see i have this i have this i have this i have a dishwasher i have an oven and then i have like this place it's for like oh, it's for yeah for trash don't i'm nigerian of course i'm going to keep plastics everywhere don't ask me but yeah it has like electric it came with like the pots you know the kettle and most of the dishes are here but i bought some i just washed the dishes because i cooked so i have so much cupboard space in here like i kind of like store up like you know breakfast supplements um pardon this loud noise okay then in here it's for like my plates don't ask me why it's not filled up it's literally only me and i literally just moved okay and in here i have like spices rack and then here is kind of like cutlery here is like whatever i want to keep here i don't know probably knives and i keep my pots here after they're done but they're kind of all in use so yeah but that's it so this is like my kitchen space now i want to show you people another thing that i really 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 love okay so pretty much this is my kitchen space okay but i want to show you people something that i really love and at the same time hate but okay let's just go right into it this fridge and freezer freezer and fridge wow. it's big as hell i'm not even going to lie for me it's big not that it's the biggest fridge that you've ever seen but compared to like most i've lived in a furnished apartment before right before i started youtube okay and the fridge i got it wasn't the big one it was like you know so for a furnished apartment to be giving me like this much premium like equipment i'm feeling very much blessed it's really big as hell okay i'm gonna show you guys okay ignore everything inside this <laughs> ignore everything inside my fridge right now okay but this is like my fridge i get like to have this extra freezing compartment for like chicken and past cakes and stuff and then i have the side for my fruits and this and whatnot here and then when it comes to the freezer i have this space which is actually a lot of space for what i eat to be very honest for the kinds of things i buy so that's the fridge and to be very honest the only downside of this fridge is that it's gonna make me realize that i'm broke <laughs> because tell me why i don't think a hundred dollars or two hundred dollars can even fill up this fridge probably might but i'm not sure that it's going to be like so filled up so this space is just a realization that we need money yeah, that's just it so that's the fridge compartment and it's kind of spacious and i really really like it it's very aesthetically pleasing for me yeah and there is something that i didn't have before in, like in my furnished apartment that i'm so proud that i actually do have it which is a dining table because before i started youtube okay so it's not like i've actually posted this before i don't think i even have a picture to like, put up on the screen of what it looked like my studio apartment was a studio it wasn't even a studio they literally said it was a one plus one but 
it was like minus one minus one i wasn't seeing nothing there was no space to even keep my slippers i couldn't get even 10 steps around the apartment but yeah that's it so there wasn't even any place to keep like a dining table or whatnot but today or currently i have a dining table okay so this is like my you know dining slash a little work table my laptop is here my you know gadgets whatever is there and wipes ignore this biggest bottle of water i know but yeah this is like really cute because it's marble like i'm a diehard fan of marble and i like the like material of this chair you know it's like very very nice and the marble kind of fits this one in a way but i don't think it's like the same thing but it's like very nice for them to get like the whole mix matching vibe you get and the chair too kind of rhymes with this one too so pretty much like this is my dining space so like i said when you walk into the apartment when you go here this is where you're faced with you go to the parlor the sitting area or parlor whatever it's going to be it's not a parlor but it's not <laughs> sitting area tv my mother's view when you turn to the left you're faced with the kitchen area and yeah and you're faced with like my dining table so when you turn to the right this is the only thing in this apartment that i don't understand why they did this like who is supposed to pass these tiny holes i don't get why there's a tiny ass hole like a walkway but this is it okay when you walk here we're going into the bathroom okay now in the bathroom this is the shade like i really really love like I don't know their architecture is so beautiful like the walls if you gave me an unfurnished apartment to do this i would never think of doing it so this is like nice then hello there this is me and then the mirror space and the toilet another thing that is not so nice is the fact that i literally have to close the door so i could see the shower but pretty much this is like the shower place and yeah this is like the sink and what it comes with this is like my stuff ignore that so i have like this space yeah i have like one compartment two compartment this this blah 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 and i have a toilet pretty much that's it but you know for the youtube girlies this is like a bathroom okay because i get to like have to stand my tripod here wait i'm gonna show you now Okay, I don't know if you like, get the vibe I'm talking about, but I don't even know if I set it up well, but yeah. Yeah, this is like kind of the vibe I'm trying to like see. I get to have like my talk and get ready with me sessions in here, which is very nice because I didn't have this before. I had to like stand my shit upon whatever. But yeah, so this is like a nice angle. I could either keep it on the left here or I keep it on the right here, depending on like what angle I want. So I could change angles and I could also give you guys like this angle. Okay, so this is here, or I can keep it here, or I can keep it here. But that's nice for a bathroom, you know, thingy. Just say hi to the camera because I like to show my face. Okay, so let's go to the next place. When you walk out to the bathroom, then we're faced with the bedroom. So this is like my bedroom space. Oh, open now. Yeah. So when I walk in, I also have another nice view, like extremely nice view, okay? I have the best view and I'm so proud of it. If I probably was like two floors higher, I would be, I will be screaming like a child. But yeah, this is like the bedroom space. This is like the bed. Everything came like the bed frame, the bed, every single thing. Anything that I didn't buy, I'm going to explain to you like, okay, I didn't buy this. I, yeah, and I bought this. Does that make sense? I don't know. But yeah, the only thing missing is here. I do not have like a cupboard space yet. So they kind of provided like this hanger thingy for the moment till they deliver my cupboard, which is supposed to come this week. And I have like this side table. So basically this is the room space. And you guys say hi to my teddy. Say hi to Zoe. Her name is Zoe. Don't ask. She's my emotional support teddy bear. But yeah. So this is it pretty much so it's not bad to be very fair and square like this is like a really nice apartment if you ask me but let's keep going so when you open the door of the room and you're walking inside back to the sitting room this is what you get to see 
okay which is not a bad thing yeah i'm pretty much here yeah, there was also another thing i wanted to show i have like this cupboard space i told you guys there is so much cupboard space inside here i already hung my stuff there because you know so i have like here i keep like my shoes like shoes i wear out like really quickly and i hung like my jackets like because it's kind of cold outside not kind of cold but it's the winter it's cold so that's that then i have a space up here and this space is like for like wi-fi electricity blah 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 i don't want to put anything there and then when we come here i know you're hearing that sound i have like i don't know if you can see i have this washing machine that came in the apartment and whatnot so oh that's pretty much it so up there too i have like another compartment up there so yeah pretty much so like i said this is everything i have to show you guys also i have this they have this like um cooling and heating system so i could set like if i want the heater if i want like the ac whatever i want and it comes out from here so it's here and it's also let me show you it's also like in the room too so i have it here i have it in the room then i have the one that's kind of facing the parlor and this light is also another fruit i live for like the chandelier is chandelier okay so it's giving what it's supposed to give yeah pretty much so that's all okay so i've already like explained everything like i've showed you guys like the whole you know apartment and whatnot so personally for me i do like this apartment because it's kind of like um technically proximity to like where i go it's also a thing but you also have to put like this thing into consideration like it's kind of close to me connecting going to work and you know that and also in like right now real estate and buying or renting an apartment it's crazy it's crazy everywhere but like specifically in turkey bruh it's so expensive because you have to think about so many things you have to they they i don't know they just the price is over the roof anybody has a budget of 300 dollars for rent anymore like it's long gone except you're staying in a shared apartment we furnished so the reason why it's that price is because i have to now explain this to you guys okay technically when you want to move into an apartment i think it's everywhere you have to pay a deposit you have to pay a commission then you have to pay the rent depending on like how many months or how many years contract you have with them so technically i have a contract with them and i have to pay like two months deposit i have to pay one commission then i have to pay the rent then i also had to pay like a management fee so everything summing up was what got me to that price of money okay so it's not like i just had to pay that one money for rent no no wow no that was just like you know saying okay the breakdown the whole money it took me to move in here was that okay so yeah basically that's it and i mean i think it's nice to me like i was saying i feel like it's nice it's kind of like you know it's just the vibe i want because it's it's fully furnished i mean and also this is another reason why i forgot to say this this is another reason why i really love this apartment because usually when you rent an apartment you have to do things like open electric bills you have to do stuff like um, open a wi-fi bill i didn't have to do those things like pretty much it came with the apartment so let's say it's kind of like an airbnb but isn't so all those things are actually sensible for why the price is that way if you ask me because if you have to think about the price of furnishing an apartment you have to think about okay i have to open bills or i have to pay this bill i have to pay what i pay this pay that if you actually accumulate that thing you're doing monthly bro you're probably spending way over the price of this apartment per month you know so yeah pretty much it's the shit for me i really like it i really like like the convenience i like the vibe and it's also like around like a mall the mall is just like here there's a gym there is the gym in this condo my title is, is dead like the gym in this condo I, it's just literally treadmill and two dumbbells i don't know who wants to walk out there and a tennis rack that i don't like but there is a gym that is just outside like it's two minutes walk so yeah but i haven't gone there i'm probably going to explore it in another vlog 
okay because i really want to start the gym this year i need to get back in the gym so yeah let me know your thoughts in the comment section and let me know what you think about this apartment and if you think it was actually worth it or not and do not forget to like share and subscribe i know this video was kind of short but pretty much i don't have much to say there's nothing more i can say now yeah so <laughs> yeah, i hope you like share subscribe and i hope you love this video see you guys in another vlog bye